hasn't been a donation in a long time. Also, we still don't have a YouTuber banner. I do need a banner. I will make it myself. Also, enjoy the new... Enjoy the new emo emotes that are added. The animated nod. Hypers. Lucy Hypers. So you can say now Hypers in chat. And you can do the Lucy Hypers. Yes. Thank you very much for the don't know. Oh, Billy. It's locked. A carving of armor. Oh, no. This is literally going to be trial and error now, isn't it? Yes, Hyper. Lucy Hyper. Hyper's in chat. This is going to be a bunch of trial and error now. Because I don't remember where the shield key is supposed to go. more emotes killing wait wait before I go here there was another door somewhere around here in here oh wait no there's not oh my gosh there was a door here. But apparently not. Apparently I was a, I was mistaken. There is no door here. I thought there was a door. There is no door. Oh baby. Why not playing the best Resident Evil? Other people lazily play the Resident Evil 4 remake. Why play the remake of 4 when you can just play the original one? The best one? And then do the right thing and move forward one Resident Evil at a time. Is what brave people do. You know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? Brave people play, play the whole series from the start. This code Veronica. We're gonna play it, don't worry. Wait, what was the order that you've recommended me? Oh, that was actually good. That was actually a good maneuver on my part. What was the order? One, two, three. I think I need to put... Ah! 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 
I think this can kill me, actually. Oh. One zero two three. I don't get it. Zero is a remake. Why not one two three, and then zero one? Why play a remake? Why play a remake after? Why play a remake in between the originals? Like I am going to play the remake of one. I just want hugs, yeah, they want to hug me to death. is a rem like zero was made for gamecube from zero so it has like a, the graphics of resident evil 1 remake i think it was even made after resident evil 1 remake so it, it sort of like feels you know yeah yeah it was made after the Resident Evil 1 remake. So it has the graphics of the remake, you know? So it will feel a bit strange to switch from PlayStation graphics to HD remake graphics to back to PlayStation graphics, you know? I think we should play I think we should just play through all the originals first and then through the remakes, you know? I don't think I don't think mixing it up is beneficial. You know? I love Moonlight Sonata. But your recommendation was different before. Your recommendation was different last time. Shield. Wait, hold on. Something's something's clearly not right. Something's wrong, Giggler. Something's wrong. 
around. Giggling. Wasle. Giggling. The doggies are horrible. You bastard. No, 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 no. Oh my god. I love Eternal Sonata. Okay, there must be something here for me. I'm still fine. I'm surprised. It's locked. Everything's armor. Give me a shield. Come on. I think this is the Jill Sandwich place. This is the bathroom. Unsegregated bathroom. Sandwich. True. Absolute mother quackers. Helmet. Helmet. Okay. Oh no, it's this this place. Oh no. Ay ay ay. Okay. So there are crows here. See? Can I kill them? Can I kill them or are they unkillable for now? I could just kill them now. Oh my god! This sucks! How the what? <sighs> oh my god. Well apparently not because they've just killed me. We're so behind now. Yeah, I should take a shotgun. I swear. For moments like this. Oh, we're back here again. Who is DSP? I have no clue. Who is DSP? Are you mocking me? Are you mocking me? Oh my god. I have no I don't even know who DSP is. Albert was scared of that. Oh, 
Why? Why did I do this? Okay, we might as well kill ourselves. Who? A garbage is this? He's bad at the game or garbage as if a horrible human? That's a difference. I'm gonna suck on this. It's a super insult. Listen. It's been a long time. It's been a long time. Donate for this social link. We are nearing the goal for chill as well. <laughs> what the? Oh my god. Okay, I'm not even gonna comment. That should have been a perfect avoid. Also keep in mind I'm I really got how you say Resident Evil. I'm not used to the tank controls anymore, okay? Capcom got rid of them. I'm used to Resident Evil having just regular controls now with the stick. Well, of course I'm gonna push the buttons in the wrong order. What do you think? You expect me to know the correct order right off the bat? You think I'm some sort of a genius? Like... Saving up for a second Nintendo Switch. I have zero Nintendo Switches. Oh my gosh. And you're saving up for a second one. Oh my god, some people are just rich. I literally have zero Nintendo Switches. Them, what do you mean? What do you mean? I don't understand. Aiming is not that great in Resident Evil original, okay? It's not that great. Unless you're speaking with the shotgun.
Oh, it's then. Five dollars. It's five dollars. It's five dollars. I don't remember what. I don't. I only remember that part. I only remember the part of angrily saying that it's five dollars and nothing else. Oh, tell us about it, some new static. Tell us about your calling. Did you debate President Sunday? Did you debate? Should I debate President Sunday? Is it time? Should I call in? I'll be like, debate me. Debate me, President Sunday. I will defeat you. In the market board of ideas. How did the Colin go? What did you talk about? Oh, oh Barry! Oh, Barry! Uh-oh. Oh, you unlocked it. subject I wanted to talk about and you gave me some pointers now. Being a man should debate him on which Resident Evil game is the best Resident Evil game. I've used the lockpick. Should I just go in the into the waiting room chat thing? Hold on. On not being a man? What do you mean? Are you saying I should debate President Sunday out of being a man? Yeah, he's playing the worst Resident Evil game. Resident Evil 1 is clearly better than Resident Evil 4, of course. I only like one, two colors waiting, so definitely up there. Oh, I'm gonna click there and click myself into the... guests but if I go into the guests the person will start talking to me in the waiting room you know and I don't want to talk to anyone in the waiting room what should I do but if I mute myself I also mute you know if I mute it then I'll also be muted when when President Sunday brings me in so I will not be able to know when I'm in. This is my dilemma. This is my dilemma. What should I do? What should I... What should I do? What should I do? Resident Evil 2 didn't have a dodge, not the original.
Yeah, but if I mute them, then when President Sunday brings me in, I will be muted and I won't hear it. I will not hear President Sunday when he brings me in. That's the problem. Wait, can I mute individual people? Let me check. But that would be rude ex as heck if I just muted the person without warning and they talk to me and I just don't hear it. That would be so rude. No? Play the piano. Oh, wrong thing. Wrong item. Oh my god. And the person waiting is a ghoul. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please advise me. Okay, I know what I will do. I will go in, mute them. Somebody should inform them that I'm muting. And then I will just keep an eye on Discord. True. The game is sexist. Or is it... Okay, how do I... Uh-oh. Okay, I have muted just this particular person. There you go. Their volume is at zero. Which means I will not hear them even if they speak. But they can hear me. The ghoul can hear me. Well, not anymore. I've muted my mic. So the ghoul cannot hear me anymore. Oh, the ghoul has been brought in. Okay, no problem anymore. No problem. I can unmute the mic or something and just wait to be brought in. All right. And then I'm going to debate President Sunday on everything. I'm going to debate him hardcore. Somebody joined in. So I have muted the new person that came in. And just in case I'm muting my mic. Damn ghouls. I'm next. I'm next in line. I'm gonna debate you. I'm gonna debate, debate, debate. All right. OK, 
okay, we've got the emblem. We've got the... Wait, have I gotten the ruby? No. Oh, wait, I have not... Okay, it's... That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Everything's okay. It's gonna be a heated debate. Did you think I was gonna be debating whilst playing Resident Evil? I bet you did not. I bet you did not. Use. the mansion key yes I will I will take the mansion key okay let's go let us go because I don't remember what to do will you take the blue je jewel yes where was the... Rock out with your clock out. Ducks. It's the best emote. Okay. Okay, can you remind me... Can you remind me where... The where's that? Where's the crow thing? I don't remember. I already forgot where to go. The Popeye walk of shame. Okay. Okay. How did I strike on here? Why just why? What do you mean? No, it's not here. I'm going the wrong way. Am I going the wrong way? As always. Yeah, crow puzzle. Am I going the wrong way again? Am I mistaken? Am I mistaken on this? Is it here? It's okay. Armor. Me armor. I think it might be here. Yeah, I think it's here. Is it here? No, it's, it's not here. I think it's downstairs. It's okay. It's because I'm streaming. So I'm multi fluctuating. Wait, 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 wait. Maybe the door is open now. It's okay. It's okay. No. It's okay. I have not been brought in just yet. locked I need a you know what I need a lighter lighten up lighten up folks I need a lighter I need a lighter 
Lighten up. Warmer. Warm, warmer bros. Warmer brothers. Uh oh. Where am I now? Wait, that's wrong. Oh my gosh, I have to destroy the zombie. Too inconvenient. Technically speaking, this way of reloading is also a quote-unquote cheat. Technically speaking, you should not be reloading like this. Alright, I'm here. I am here. I'm ready. I'm gonna destroy them. I'm gonna kill you! How many of those crows are here? Three? This is all of them, right? There is no more, right? Wait, there is more! How can you kill all of them in one shot if there are so many? Okay. What do I do? There's a message. Give me the piece of death and I'll give you the joy of life. There's a switch below. Will you push it? No. A picture of a bald looking old man. There's a switch. A picture of a lively boy. Lucy. There's a switch below. Will you push it? No. Wait. Bald boy. Bald boy. Picture of an infant. There is a switch below. Will you press it? No. A picture of a young man. There is a switch below. Will you push it? No. No! A picture of a newborn baby. There is a switch below. Will you push it? No. A picture of a tired middle aged man. The switch below, will you push it? No. The title is Give Me Peaceful Sleep. Okay. We're trying, we're going to try the puzzle. Worst case scenario, we'll just um, die or something. Picture of a newborn babe. That there's a new switch below. Will you push? Okay, so far so good. A picture of an infant. There's a switch below. Will you push? Yeah. 
Okay, okay. <gasps> that scared me, motherfucker. Better of a lively boy. Where's the switch below? Will you push? <gasps> yes! Alright! A picture of a young man. Where's the switch below? Will you push? Yes! Alright, so far so good! Bald boy! Alright, let's go, let's go! Picture of a tired middle-aged man. There's a switch below. Will you push it? Yes. <gasps> <gasps> Finally, bald boy. A picture of a bald boy. There's a switch. Will you push? Yes. All right. Now, finally, we push this button. There's a message. Give me the peace of death and I'll give you the joy of life. There's a switch below. You push it. Yeah. I've done it! Yay! Yeah. Come on. Giggling. You take the star crest. I use this. Combine. Check. A carving of the star. A carving of the star. A carving of the... I have no idea what to do with this. Unfortunately, as amazingly as we did in this puzzle, it actually has not helped us at all. It has not helped us at all. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Where am I? I need to check the map non-stop. Okay, I know where I am now. Open the door. Mother walker. It's locked. Curving of a helmet. Yeah, hypers in chat. Ooh. Ooh. Usually dogs here in the remake at least. Oh no, doggy! Come on. Come on. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Calm, Calm down, please. Oh my god. Oh my god! I didn't want to press this. I want to press start. You know, menu. Run away! Oh my god! Oh my god! Doggy! What the? How did you get? Oh my god! You thinking my? I should have destroyed you with a shotgun. I'm. Oh, I'm not fine anymore. We should save or something. I don't know. Especially since I have no clue where to go now. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think I know. I think I know. Maybe I know. I'm not 100% sure. Where am I? We might as well save, right?
Yeah, yeah let's save. I might as well. Wait till you go to the hunter mining. Angry bomb. Angry bomb. Quackers. President Sunday is playing Resident Evil 4. I'm playing Resident Evil 1. And President Sunday is talking to a ghoul. Also, how's the pop filter? Is it helping anything? Have I mentioned we're using a pop filter? Have I mentioned this to you? I told you my secrets. Have I told you my secrets? Or no? Have I never told you my deepest secrets? It sounds good? All right. That is a good thing to hear. Pop filter. It's a microphone gizmo that allows me to filter weird noises such as popping. So that I'm not a Mary Poppins. Mary Poppins. Pop filter. Oh, let's go here. It's lot armor. Everything's armor. Where's the? Oh my god! This game is conspiring against me. Where's the shield? Giggle filter. Okay, where am I now? I'm here. Okay, we're looking for a door with a shield. We're looking for a door with a shield. I didn't expect to be stuck on something like this, but there we are. A carving of armor. <clears throat> Where's a legend when you need one? Am I back in time for the Jill sandwiches? You are. You're back in time for me to be stuck and and not be able to find the right door. So you're definitely back in time for that. Okay, where am I? Okay. 
Okay, I'm here. This is the door here. So it has to be this door. What? Armor? Again? Armor? Oh, you. Where is the shield? Game is gaslighting. Gaslighting me. Gaslighting. Okay, where am I? Oh my gosh, the game is gaslighting me. Duck lighting me. But it's okay. We're gonna do it. We can do it. to be here has to be here somewhere right has to be one of those two doors or else I'll be very cross it's locked helmet keypad and I don't know the pass number What is going on? And now I need to avoid the zombies again. Wait, hold on. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm not. I mean, I am. I cannot find the door. I'm locking. I'm locking. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Okay. Listen. Listen carefully here. Needs to be the thing in the back, right? Zombies, no more problem. I've played only Chris storyline. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Also, wonderful, wonderful, you should join the page. Welcome to the stream. Use the eye. There we go. Ooh, we've got a crest. Okay. So we've got two out of four. I'm already cautious as well. That's not good.
Oh, that's not a thing in the original. It was supposed to be a thing in the original, but in the end it was only a thing in the remake. No, the Crimson Zombies are not a thing in the original. That was only that that's only a thing in the remake. But as I've just said, it was planned for the original, but it never made it into the content. And the idea was revived for the remake. Oh, I'm all I'm gonna be brought in, maybe. Let's see. Bring on the next one, people. Hey, Lucy, how you doing? Oh, I'm in. Hello. Hey. I'm here I hear you're playing, uh, I hear you're playing Resident Evil. Yeah, one. The original is Jill. And I'm stuck. I don't stuck know where to Jill go. Stuck with Jill's easy mode. How can you be stuck? Because I can't find the door. Hmm. I don't remember where the door is. I have a key with a shield, and I don't remember where the shield door is. Me neither. I gave up. I'm here to debate you. Oh, on well, what? Well. On everything. I don't. I will think of something. Okay, well, you're out of luck because I'm an expert on everything. What, sorry? What? What happened? I said you're uh, you're out of luck because I'm an expert on everything. Oh, so you're just like Stephen. Exactly. Do you know? Actually, Stephen may know everything, but I know a little bit more of everything than Stephen does. Oh. Do you know more about it than 99% of people? I know more about it than 101% of people. Oh, wow. That's more than Stephen. 1.5. Yeah. Damn. That's way more than Stephen. That is more than Stephen. I've actually done a video on our mutual friend, Child Logic, a new one. Mm -hmm. Not sure if you've seen it. Well, haven't you? In which oh, Chad Logic it. basically said pretty openly that he was a nobody be before DK made his career. You know? That's pretty sad. It is pretty sad. Basically, he said I was a 7K st like streamer who just made a couple of hundred dollars per month. And then DK came and changed everything, you know? Oh yeah, and also he said that um, it's okay to hire a Nazi as long as they keep their beliefs at home and do a good job. Um, depends. Um. If we're talking about someone who has those beliefs and isn't antisocial off the clock, I'd agree. Um, they do their job. They aren't host. They aren't like harassing people, well, off the job or on the job. That's like I don't don't like it, but that's their business. I don't care. Um, the problem with DK is that that's not what he's doing. I think that in a real life work setting, being an open Nazi would not work, even if one would not. I, I don't it think work. it would either. But in the abstract, like, I don't know. You, you can't really like police what? people's ideas to a certain extent, insofar as they are private. True. If they're not treated as private, that's a different. But. Salamander. I think the fact is that at this. When one openly hires a Nazi to their company, brand, or whatever, then basically the brand gets associated with it, whether they only want it or no, not. No, no, no. If, if, well, here's the thing. Like, if they're, if they're known to be a Nazi, yeah, that, that means it, isn't, it hasn't been kept private. This yeah. isn't just like an idea they have. Right. This isn't like a proclivity they have. Their, their grandfather was a racist or whatever, but they know how to operate in, in like general society and not be toxic towards the people they engage with. So people just don't know. Right. Sure. The problem with is that like, it's like the word conservative. If you if you're a, I don't I don't think DK is a Nazi to be clear, but if you're a if you're a Nazi, um, it's actually unambiguous about your attitudes toward particular things. Oh. Um, the fact of knowing you're a Nazi um, implies a statement. DK is actually like a, pretty like, 
not significant to the point because Chad Logic just said that he's okay with hiring a Nazi, you know? That's as long as it uh, like as yeah. long as the Nazi gives him revenue and does not bring oh. the Nazi thing into the work. Okay, well that's 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 pretty weak. Um it's pretty silly. Like to me that indicates that Chad Logic does it's not silly know for a couple of reasons. It's yeah, silly to yeah. say that if you're gonna do it. It's also silly to do it because people will find out about the connection that you're kind of passively accepting of it. At that point, it becomes like basically becomes on brand for you to hire Nazis, literally. And also, uh, yeah, um, we're now going to be covered on Chud Logic, by the way. Thank you for that. It's okay. <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> I've already been um, covered twice. On Chad Logic. And uh, once you don't, you don't need to you don't need to sell me on on DK being a, a bad person to associate with. And once by Queeman, his friend. Also today on the premiere, Chad Logic's audience like entered the chat to to uh, say that chat? Yeah. To tell me that I should DM them on Discord so that they can explain my misconception about DK threatening the mods on Discord and I I am spreading misinfo. Um I, I feel like that's been done to death, but like I'm not gonna tell you not to. No I didn't. Like the truth is that it's not really misinfo if Chad Logic himself acknowledged it and said that he dealt with it. Mm-hmm. You know, at this point, it's like he acknowledged it. Because if it was nothing, that he would have nothing to deal with. I think. No, it's ongoing stuff. It's like the... He didn't just, like, say rude things, right? He wasn't just, like, bigoted in his language. Oh, yeah, he threatened people with doxing. Pretty open. Implied doxing. Digging stuff up on them. Right. Sorry, hang on one sec. Sorry, just part of food is very chewy. Um, he didn't Do just I threaten have... people. He didn't just threaten people either. He also like fabricated DMs to make people like rise them. He also did this to me um, oh, to make it appear as, as as though people were like sexting minors. Like that could be career destroying. I work for myself, so like I'm I'm pretty safe. But like for someone like Rhizome, who's I believe a school teacher, right? Um, if anybody made that connection, that's like. That's, that could be a career death sentence. Right. Um, yeah, like, it's, it's actually very serious. Hey, did you just say that you were a school teacher? Just, did I say I was a school teacher? No, I'm not a school teacher. Okay. No, ry Rhizome is. Or okay. was, at least. Oh, yeah. I'm not sure if he's still present here. I'm a language school teacher. At least I taught in a few language schools. Right. I've got a topic for you. Sure. Because I have listened to your debates with people that are basically not very, that are, mm, well, I guess morally bankrupt would be the phrase. And you've seen trans voices debate with destiny, right? Uh, I've seen them once or twice. Oh, she only debated Destiny once, right? On uh, music. Who, Mama? No, no. Trans voices. Oh, trans voices. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's the music person. Yeah. Uh, but she has a whole channel. As, yeah, sorry, sorry. I, I thought, sorry, when you said trans voices, I assumed you were like speaking generally about trans yeah, her, her channel is. You yeah, know, like... I've got, a, I've got these, I've got the segment on my channel of that. Yeah, I was talking about that with the last uh, guest. Oh. So do you think that you could, do you, do you see yourself adapting some of her strategies into your own discussions with people like that? Yeah, she's very good. Now, granted, like a lot of, it wasn't stra strategic. A lot of what she was able to do was just by dint of having just a superior grasp of the field. So 
like like to be able like one of the most powerful rhetorical moves you can you can have make um is to be able to counter someone's explication by saying no it's actually the opposite of that and then be able to give like a cogent explanation of why yeah which is she was able to do i wouldn't be able to do that in that context in not most in context I of do that. that's mm -hmm. like yeah she knows her stuff in a big way not in a context of music but i you have debates about political theory right uh, sure. Sure, yeah. And it Even then, though, like, political theory is super broad. It wouldn't take much to, like, outstrip me. Um, if you, if you study, like, any facet of it for a year and up, you'll, you'll run circles around me and something. Right. Yes, it depends on the uh, topic, because I believe that usually it's a good stratagem to sort of allow people to sort of people usually say hang themselves on their okay. weird you know tangents and then calmly dismantle them if that makes sense yeah I mean optically that's always better unless like there's there's a good setup where flipping out on them is cathartic for the audience right. sometimes that does work but it's it's a particular case like I think that would be the best strategy with someone like Steven, I think so. Steven? It depends. Um, I, I think I think uh, for trans voices, how she did that was um, basically unbeatable. That was one of the best performances I've ever seen. Yeah. Was, he was basically shown to be out of his depth. Like, the funny thing about that is, like, I've heard Destiny say in a clip recently that, oh, Audience keeps saying that I'm arrogant because they keep saying that I know everything. I don't know everything. And it's it runs pretty... What, you don't? You mean you've been lying to me? Well, it runs counter to all of his claims because not so long ago before this statement, he said, Oh, I don't know. Sometimes I don't know things, but I just read on them briefly and even that brief reading is more than 99% of people <laughs> you know yeah just sells himself as knowing everything on every subject ever and it's or at the very least like conversant with every subject ever like he doesn't need to know everything he can like there are, there are cases where you'll see him like talk to someone and he'll accept, like, criticism or, like, exposition or whatever. Yeah, but he will um, add a classification It's really of... important that he's not just out of his depth, ever. Right. But Which, will... like, I get on a certain level, because it's like, if you're an entertainer, um, nobody wants to see somebody just kind of, like... Yeah. You know... He will always out. add the qualifier of knowing more than 99% of people about the subject. Which, even I mean, to when... be fair, is, might, might be true, but it's not setting a high bar. Well... I mean, the U.S. education is sort of like, uh, I'm not sure if deserved or not deserved. It has a reputation on high school level of being very low. I'm not sure. It's not great here either. The Canada one compares. Like, I know that places in like Poland or Germany... High school is basically prep school for university. Is that the function of high school in as Canada? As a, a university? Like a prep school for university. No, God, no. Like you go through high school. In certain years, you sort of specialize the subject um, depending on and you tailor it to the university that you eventually want to go to. Basically, never know. Oh. Like that's that's actually it's very one size fits all. Oh, that's the goal of high school to sort of prepare a person mm -hmm. for university. You toss this for me. Thanks so much. And if one doesn't want to go to university, they usually go to a school that just prepares a person to get a job right after it. Uh, it basically prepares you for nothing. A lot of uh, first and second year university here is uh, remedial high school. 
It's it's bad. Education here is in a very bad state. Unless you're one of the lucky people who goes to like one of the well-funded schools. One of the wealthier parts of the island or parts of BC or parts of Canada. Well-funded um, yeah. public schools or... Yeah, public school. Or okay. private school. There are private schools. Right. In Poland, it's less about funding and more like about the reputation that the school builds for itself. Yeah. And there's like this list of the ranking, right? Yeah. And people send the people like their kids to the best high schools. You pass an exam to go to the high school. And right now, Um, you pass a final exam in high school and you get admitted to a university depending on the score on your final high school score exam. I mean, like, of course, like, they'll let you into universities here based on your um, high school performance. But there's very little tailoring that goes on in most cases. Right, but the thing is that the university... That you will, that you can go into based on your high school score, will be free, <laughs> hmm. because it's public. Well, we're we're heavily subsidized. Like a university here is much cheaper than it is in the states. Right. So there is that. Like that's that does offset a little bit. Like a lot of the problems of um, <clears throat> the the public school system. Um, it's a little bit. A little, little bit. Of course, um, there's... Because people can afford to take, like, an extra year. People right. can afford... Or more people can afford, I should say. Um, because, like, in in the United States... Uh, this is, this is like, the rundown. So, if you spend, like, $50,000 for a year of education in the States, mm -hmm. you'll spend about $10,000 here. Okay. Yeah. That's a lot cheaper. Um... Sometimes you can you can get through for as as little as like four thousand dollars. That's just tuition, um, but like four thousand dollars for a full course load. Okay. Um, for like a, a winter and uh, spring semester. So, do people come here from the U.S. to study cheaper? Uh, sometimes a lot of people from uh, China and Japan come here. Um, okay. A lot of people from China come here. A lot of people from all over the world come to the Polish medical university because it's a lot cheaper than anywhere else. A lot of uh, a lot of um, Lebanese students, I think. Um, definitely a lot more recently, from from what I've noticed, um, in uh, at my university at least. I'm trying uh, to think of where else people come from. Um, very few people from, from Europe, oddly. I, I don't, I don't remember seeing, like, many... I think Poland might be a many, cheaper like, people for from, medicine, like, at least. Or Sweden or wherever. For medicine, Poland, Poland is a cheap destination for foreigners. Yeah. And, so, oh, and so surprisingly few, like, uh, Indian students. This is just based off of, like, eyesight, so... Yeah. Um, so, like, pro <laughs> Probably a lot of uh, Indian students that just aren't like, you know, my, my brain would just register as, as from India at that site, but, um, uh, not, not a ton of them, although, um, while American students don't come here that frequently, a lot of Americans do teach here. So one of my best professors was a ex-law student from, um, the US. from, uh, I can't, where was he from? California? I can't remember. Of course, lawyer stuff is very tricky because well, he lawyer... was a, he he was he was a a, a law school student who went right. into um, religious and medieval studies, and he taught okay. religious studies. He was very because good. like the law is very country based, right? Like, uh, yeah, but like legal theory um, it extends beyond just like knowing the, the writ of the law in your home country. Right. But so a lot of, if you're, in, if you're like, a, practice, like a scholar of, of like international law or, or things like that, then you'll, you'll deal with a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah. But I know, I know that practicing lawyers do not sort of usually practicing lawyer when dealing with a case that is about 
a lot of from a different country they usually won't do it on their own they will usually ask for help from a lawyer from that country right off the bat you know sorry Ugh, got a squid head here I know my friend does it like that usually asks for help he, he doesn't know more than 99% of people around the world about law <laughs> well that's unfortunate I can't imagine what that would be like but that must be rough um, I'm gonna let in uh, I'm gonna let in Daedalus because we have one more person waiting behind him okay um, but it's been great chatting uh, come on next time and uh, shout at your channel before you go right I have a YouTube called Lucy Hadze and I also now have a white forest page. Oh nice. Did yeah. uh who who set you up with that? White Nervosa. Oh nice. Cool. So the address for that is luciaze.org slash live. Same. All right. Well, uh, it's been a pleasure, Lucy. You have a good night. Okay. I'll see you. Take care. Okay. All right. So we have done it. We have debated and defeated President Sunday in the market board of ideas. And now I have no clue where to go. Still. Normie. Hello, Normie. Okay, where do I go? I have no idea where a shield is. You have to take this seriously now. Mm. Oh, I know! Wait! Hold on! I know what to do! Why am I being so silly? Okay, let's go! Oh my gosh! <gasps> I know now what to do! Where, where, where am I? Oh, I'm here. I know my way again. See? I use my big brain. Let's go. I remember what to do. My my brain things have been triggered for up to action. In the meantime, tell me how is everyone? His inside prison Sunday could destroy Mr. Rowan. Stephen couldn't. True. That is true. So, how are you all? I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Go here. You're gonna see what I'm gonna do. You're gonna be proud of me. Are you gonna be proud of me or why? I think so. I think you will. When your static is sleepy. What are you working on? Are you working on your thesis about giggling? Look here. This is what I have to do. Chemical X. Let's go. 
go. I am so ready. Cannot believe only like Square it's in the Starware Transitions GameCube remake any rooms connected by stairs or just one big room true. And that's what makes the remake so great. It aged the GameCube remake aged so well. But they didn't need to remake it, they just upscaled it to HD and removed the tank controls and that was it. They didn't they didn't really need to touch the GameCube remake. We've got eighty dollars out of three hundred. Well done. We have gathered eighty dollars. Out of 300. It's really good. Amazing even. Now watch me. It still looks good, yeah. I'm telling you, all they had to do is to... Upscale it to HD. They basically just changed the resolution of the remake and removed the tank controls. And it holds up perfectly. Both graphics and gameplay wise. Which is amazing. The original holds up because it's super goofy, especially when it comes to the voice acting and the real live, the live action sequences. Hey, look. This is gonna happen. It's happening. Look. Okay. Wait, what? Oh! Okay. Let's go. Yeah! Are you seeing this? I'm a genius. Dead. It's dead. The plant is dead. It is dead, right? It cannot hurt me anymore, right? I don't think it will, to be honest. I don't think they will remake one like that. Like, they really did that remake of the first game really, really well. Will you take the mansion key? Will you take the manlet key? What kind of key is this? Armor! This basically opens every door in the game. Alright. Full of herbs. 
Will you take the green herb? I think they will do it once they run out of all Resident Evil games to remake. And not before. Not before! You understand me? My feelings? You take the green herb. Yes. So many herbs! You take the green herb. We're gonna take all of these herbs and we're gonna put them in a chest. Wait, Resident Evil Zero has graphics of Resident Evil 1 Remake. Resident Evil Zero is basically on the level of 1 Remake. They should remake Code Veronica, if anything. Like, I think they can confidently leave Zero and One alone and remake Code Veronica. I think that would be the best Resident Evil to remake, personally. I walk, the famous sailor walk. Okay, we're gonna do a few runs the chest. I hope you will not be angry with me about it. Yeah, it was a game they made on the engine of one remake, yeah. It was a very specific Resident Evil game. It was like Zero was like no other Resident Evil game before or after it. In Resident Evil 4, you have a person that accompanies you, but it's not the same as in Resident Evil 0. Resident Evil 0 has a very specific gameplay. I don't think any other Resident Evil games have quite the gameplay like Zero. And I don't mean it in the good or bad sense, I mean it in the it's very different kind of sense. The fact that you could leave all the items on the floor. The like the biggest thing in Zero was the inventory management. The fact that uh, the both characters had to swap items, leave them on the floor. Etc. That it was a co-op but it basically played like a classic Resident Evil game and not like an action-packed shooter like 4 or 5.
Yeah. We're going to play it from the beginning because we're doing a whole big arc for Resident Evil right now. Squid for hire. This is going to be okay. This is going to be okay. That's why I must That's why we must take all of the herbs and put them in a box I don't want to go back here We create a great stash of herbs, then we won't be able, we won't have to be afraid anymore. Two more greens. That's just great. I should have put away the shotgun ammo. Only one more green. Still a lot. Should I leave the red one here? I think it's fine if we leave the red one here. Or is it? Hypers in chat if you think I should go back and get the red bit. Go back for the red herb or move on. That is my question to all of you and all three chats. That is mm, a third choice. Okay, I'm gonna get it. Boosts the heal. Sometimes it's good to have that boost heal. Might as well leave the ammo. Yeah. Green herb. Okay. So we go to for the last plant. And then we're starting to open the doors one by one. Exploring all the area because the armor key just happens to open a lot of doors. So 
we might as well explore all of it. Right? We also need more ink ribbon. At this point it would be nice to save, but I've got zero ink ribbon. I think I've got zero ink ribbon. I don't think I've got any. So that is a problem. We ain't got no ink ribbon. Nobody's speaking, everybody's super focused on the game. Everyone is hyper focused. In the newer games, when you don't need a key anymore, the game asks you if you want to discard it. I don't think that was a thing in the old as in evil in the originals. The originals I think you just keep the keys forever. And you have to put them in the chest. You know? So that's uh, like a big quality of life change. What is your board game? I'm wondering if I should do the segment. Okay, everybody in chat answer this question but with yes or no. Should I do the segments now or next time? Have two short things sort of prepared. Exactly, but sort of, sort of, sort of, yes. Okay, we've got the... I think there already are things on this board, on this floor, that I can use, open. So what do you think? Segments today or next time?
What do you think? All right, we've used the armor key. It's a uh, next step. I think there is like actually I think there's more herbs in here. There used to be herbs in the remake. A lighter! Alright. That's good. That is what I need. Clip. Clipped and shipped. Clipped and shipped. situation went from not so good to pretty good actually ink ribbon I can save the game now I think this might have been the place in the game where you do the Butterfly thing. I think they added the butterfly puzzle. Unless the butterfly puzzle is also here. In which case it's okay. In which case it's okay. Then we continue. I don't even remember if you have to fight the snake as Jill. I don't remember if you save, if you need to save Rebecca as Jill or not.
we go here. We've saved, we feel a little bit more secure. Oh, it's still a thing. Since someone has searched here already, there appears to be a switch. Will you push it? What is the implication that Chris has already been here? Researchers will. My dear Alma, the fact that you have received this letter is both a joy and a sadness for me. I could not even talk to you because of that guy in the sunglasses. Alma, be calm and read this guy in sunglasses. What a subtle hint as to Wesker's identity. I think I've told you that I moved to a pharmaceutical company's lab. They had hunted me. Last month, there was an accident in the lab, and the virus we were studying escaped. All my colleagues who were infected by the virus are dead. To be accurate, they've become the living dead. They still wander around. Some of them are knocking on my room door desperately right now. There's no sign of intelligence in their eyes. That cursed virus takes away all humanity from the human brain. Love, joy, sorrow, fear, humor, eternally. And Alma, even the memories of the days I spent with you. Yes, I am infected. I did everything I could, but I could only delay the progress by a few days. The most frightening thing is that I forget more about you by the day. So I chose a peaceful death rather than becoming the living dead. Within, a, within an hour, I will have entered my eternal sleep. I do hope you'll understand my decision. Goodbye and forever yours. Martin Crackhorn? Okay, that took away from the mood a bit. Martin Crackhorn. Okay. Okay, Mr. Crackhorn. I'm sorry, Crackhorn is a little bit anticlimactic. Imagine the girl saying, I once dated a scientist called, I once, I dated a scientist once. His name was Crackhorn, but then he just ghosted me, because from her perspective, he just ghosted her. Ghosted by a scientist called Crackhorn. Must be rough. That was absolutely necessary. All right, we're gonna go and use the lighter. Crack horn, not ghost horn, crack horn.
It is important to know the distinction. The fire does not look so good. Oh, it's a map. It's a map. Fire looks so funny. The fire does look funny. Okay, so we've got a few things in here. I don't think I need that for now. Okay, now we're in a pretty good spot all of a sudden. For real. We're going here. Um, is this open now? Open. This key opens one million doors. Should be dogs here. Yeah, there are dogs here. Oh my god. The dogs are the worst. Just caution. But, you know what? It's worth sacrificing two herbs to super expand our herb collection. We've actually got a lot of herbs now. Is there anything apart? If I defeated the dog faster, I could have had more herbs. But that's okay. I've actually got a lot. A lot of herbs. So. Uh oh. 
Luckily, we're not gonna return here ever again. This room has officially been explored. Explored. I think this door, I think this door breaks in the remake after a few uses. Hey, we've got a lot of herbs. To where? To yarn? What is a yarn? What is a yarn? You mean the thing that you like a ball of yarn that cats chase? Oh, yeah, yeah, we talked. That's right. We had a talk. We had a debate. We had a debate to the death. Which I say, I defeat you. And they said it's true. They have defeated me. And that's how it went. No, this is like I mentioned. Police station is Resident Evil 2, not 1. Resident Evil 1 is res uh, Residence, Resident Evil 2 is the station. What's happening to the control? Why? Oh my gosh. Technology. 
The controls went bonkers. I get it now. I get it now. Game almost got me. Oh, you came here for a, from a drag show. How was it? Did you get shocked by the... Improper... Things... Naked people dancing... And... Stuff... Okay... I think now the... Things are blocked. You're not guessing me today. There you go. How different was it? Was it more non-safe for word than you expected? Drag King Magician. Okay. I don't know why, but I need to go to the toilet a lot today. Also, Emmanuel, consider um, consider donating for Jill. Consider donating to Jill. We have already gathered eighty dollars. I'll be right back. I have prepared special custom things for when people donate or subscribe. Okay, I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. 